Each time I get a map, I learn something new. At age of 85, not too many people are able to do it, but this Aikido training has been very helpful for me, coping with many, many difficulties. So this whole thing started with a couple hospital trips, huh? Oh, I was so afraid of eating. I've been pretty healthy until last year. Sometimes he would eat and be fine, and a couple of times he would eat and he would get like a bowel obstruction with severe pain and nausea, and we would end up in the emergency room. They found I had very rare lymphoma cancer in my stomach. I'm not surprised. Maybe I disappointed. You only wish that you never have to hear about that. I went through conventional, traditional treatment, including major stomach surgery. In the midst of cancer treatment, I had my international Aikido festival in Japan. I was determined to participate in that tournament. His oncologist wanted to get a follow-up PET scan to see where he stood before we left. He wasn't responding how she would have wanted him to. So that's when his oncologist decided to refer him for CAR-T treatment. CAR-T, in my understanding, is when they take your own T cells and they genetically modify them to attack your cancer. It's amazing. It sounds like science fiction. <laughs> it seemed like a risky treatment with a lot of unknowns. Is it why for me to go through another round of vigorous, intense immunotherapy? When he was presented with the CAR-T treatment, he was really willing to go for it. I think that helped all of us be on board with it and be excited about it. We took on his perspective that this was a really cool chance that he had at surviving. It took three weeks to re-engineer my blood cell into new, much stronger blood cell. Then I was admitted in order to re-infuse my blood because my body was strong. I didn't suffer. I was released after six or seven days. So Dr. Hardly used cancer-free, but my oncologist used that terminology. So that was very encouraging. It felt like such a victory because it had been such a team effort. Our family felt like we beat it together. Yeah, that looks, looks good. <laughs> the cancer battle made it so uncertain how much time we were going to have left, and now we feel like we get some bonus time with him. We're really going to treasure it and not take it for granted. I know I couldn't go through all kinds of treatment by myself. My family is the one good supporting team. This technology and medical team is unbelievable. I couldn't ask better a team for that I was ever thankful to everybody got involved in my battle for cancer. <laughs>